Well, it's the day of the recce here for the Rally of Nations. It's been a long day for all of our drivers and they're not finished yet. They've got the Wanawato street stage to recce. And my goodness me, we couldn't have planned it better. 1994 World Rally Champion first into the street stage. Didier Oriel, tell me, you have been here once before, but the stages today, tell me how you found them, how were they? Okay, it was a hard day, but um, no, very interesting stage, quite uh, very smooth, uh, fast, you have a lot of uh, fast part, uh, very interesting and they must be very, very difficult and not easy, I mean, really, uh, you have a lot of crest and it's very different to feel the road, you know, you need to believe you're, you're not. So was it quite a difficult recce in that respect? Because obviously you've got no notes, a lot of the other drivers have got notes, you have to make new notes. Was it quite intense? Yeah, it's intense and you practice very slowly, you know, uh, with this car. So, I mean, uh, I mean, we can have some surprise during the race, so we are not, but it's, anyway, it's interesting rally, very nice stage. Tell me which car you're driving this weekend, did you? Uh, I drive a Subaru Group N. Yeah, so we see um, she, the car come to, to America, from America, so we see. And driving with Adrian Formo, Adrian's a real talent, isn't he? Sorry? Uh, Adrian Formo's a real talent. Ah, yes, yes, of course. Of course, it's a young French driver and uh, I expect um, that he wins this race and I think, um, you know, for, he, it's very, for him it's very important to be here because he, he learns a little bit the stage for the future. Well, they're all coming thick and fast now. Mad Zosberg, a man who's done very well here in the past. How did the stages look today? Yeah, they look really good, to be honest. It's, uh, it's like always, it looks smooth and, and fast, but also some technical parts. But uh, the stages are in really good condition, so it's going to be a lot of fun. Which one are you particularly looking forward to? This one, I think. The, the stage here is, is always amazing, so I look forward to that. Mads Osberg's teammate, Avon Bernielsen, babyface himself. A long day for you today, Avon. Yeah, it's a long day, but um, it's, it's all worth it when we are starting on Friday, so uh, looking forward to it. Is it one of your favourite rallies? It seems to be most people's favourite rally. I think so. The, the atmosphere here at the start uh, uh, ramp, it's so good. It's so many people, the spectators, the crowd, they are just mad, so looking forward to it. Mads was telling us the other day that it reminds him of driving on snow on these stages. Can you identify with that? Uh, it's pretty loose on the top. It's a lot of sand. So uh, yes, it's, uh, it's going to dig down a bit and we have, we'll find these tracks we will find on snow. So um, yeah, it's going to be difficult. Team Norway in good shape? I believe so. We're going for the victory, I think. Oh, fighting top! Uh, Matthew Wilson, how's the day been for you? Yeah, we've been all right, actually. We've, um, we've got through in our little rental car. Um, yeah, no, fine. All good. Yeah, Did you managed to avoid punctures. Apparently that was a bit of an issue for one or two of the boys out there. Yeah, we, we put the tyres up to like three bar last night. It was a bit of a trick, I think. Just to, uh, it's not been the most comfortable ride, I have to say, but um, we've got through without any punctures so far, so that's good. Stage is in good shape? They are, yeah. I think probably won't be after we do that certain uh, stage five. I think we're over it five times, I think, so it's going to be, um, I would imagine it will be fairly rough, but yeah, so far, so good. Full driver in good shape? He's doing all right. Didn't let him out in the sun during the lunch break, did you? He's looking a little bit red. Uh, he's, he's, all right, he's keeping me I fed with caramel, caramel wafers, so I'm all right. Well, we've been talking about how long a day and how difficult a day it's been out there wrecking. And as you can see, there are a variety of different recce cars being used. You know, normally we see specialist recce cars. Okay, the little green Clio there has got a roll cage in it, but a lot of them are just road cars. Now, uh, what happens when you haven't got special tires as well on recce? Well, you pick up punctures and that space saver is a little bit of a disaster. But come this way, camera boy, come this way. Look, 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 look. This is a total disaster. Two space savers. Where did you find the car with two space savers? Two punctures, at least two punctures on his recce. The poor, poor boy. Well, it really is getting rather busy here. Listen, we're talking about the recce, the stages here, classic stages on Rally Mexico. Otates, Juanamotito, De Madero. Some absolute classics, including this one. Here's a man fresh from victory, fresh from victory on the FAF rally. Niels, it's great to see you. Uh, tell me about your recce today. How has it gone? Yeah, good. Quite dusty. It was a lot of dust. Uh, it will be slippery on the rally, for sure. But 
the stages are amazing, uh, well prepared, all the ground is perfect, so we will enjoy for sure a lot. Now, have you been here before? Yeah, 2018, first time. And you were in the R5 car that year? R5, when we won the Junior WRC with uh, the, Mac, the Mac car, so yeah, with them for. Tell me which car you're in this weekend. This weekend with uh, Mitsubishi Eboten from, from UVP Garage, it's a uh, team from here, so I'm happy to be here, enjoy the stages, have a fun during this weekend and uh, be part of my Spanish team. Obviously massive interest in all of our Mexican crews this weekend. Benito Guerra is driving, as is Benito Senior. Benito Senior, yes. tell me, how was the recce, how did it go? Uh, it's a, a long way to, to get here, but uh, I'm glad I do a, a great recce today. And your notes, you, you were okay making the notes? Because it's not something you're used to doing. No, the notes are great. We did great notes and we take it just easy. Great stuff. We'll let you head off into the stage. That's Benito Guerra Sr. So we've spoken to Benny Sr. Shall we talk to Benny Jr.? Come round this side, cameraman. Come round this side. Stand here. Stand this side here. Come round this way. Round this way. Uh, Benny, a long day. A long day's wrecking. How's it been? Yeah, it has been very, very long. Uh, we have been in the stages all day. I think it's more, more than 12 hours non-stopping. So, yeah, it's it's difficult, but we have a lot of pace notes. So I think it's easier for, for us. I think some of the drivers like the Italians, Battistoli, they, like riding everything, it has to be very hard. And how are the stages looking? The stages are fantastic. I think uh, we have a, like a carpet stages. It's brand new. For, for us, so I think we are gonna have fun. They're gonna be sleeping some parts, and in the in the part of Alfaro, the first part of Alfaro, that we are gonna run four times there, like in the in the same part of the stage. It's gonna be very clean, and when it's clean, you have a lot of grip. The, the tires are screeching sometimes because it's it's very very clean now. Well, listen, you're gonna have to do a fair bit of running to keep up with your dad because your dad's found it very easy today, and he's how old is your dad? I don't know, but he's a lot older than you. He's 63, so <laughs> yeah, I'm 37. He's, he's quite drunk. <laughs> he is. Very best of luck. Cheers now. Amazing who you bump into. Amazing who you bump into. Do you know who I found loitering on the streets of Guanajuato, my favorite Italian in the whole world? Andrea Damo, you're here to do a job this weekend. Job is a big word, but theoretically, yes. Hey, listen, um, the boys and girls have been out wrecking, and you've had a look at the stages for the first time, really. What did you make of them? I have a two nice uh, driver and co-driver and a nice guy sitting aside me caring about the town and things like that. It has been nice uh, to spend time and checking the stages, uh, check some historical, mo historical moment uh, here and there. So it's been a nice, nice day. Uh, what happened yesterday, Mr. Adamo? What, what happened yesterday? I, I believe you were a little too relaxed yesterday. Did you fall asleep in the sun? Uh, not a lot, but uh, let me say I forgot that we are uh, in a high altitude, the sun is uh, peaking a bit, so I have this uh, Ringo chocolate, Ringo biscuit uh, kind of tan. If you want to see the belly, ta -da -da, I can show you the belly. Yeah, his belly, he's got a bright red, a bright red belly, the poor chap. Great to see you, Andrea. <laughs> Well, one of our current WRC stars, Adrian Formo, making his debut in Mexico this weekend. Adrian, you've had a chance to take a look at the Mexican stages. What did you make of them? It's really nice, honestly. The stages are really interesting and uh, it's really nice and flowing. Some sections are quite twisty and some, some of us are really, like, really fast. And uh, so it's quite crazy. The landscape is really nice, so yeah, I'm sure we'll have a good fun. Have you talked though to the other M Sport drivers about how the stages develop? Because that's the interesting part here. Yeah, actually, the stage looks really, really gentle for the car. Uh, after five pass, I think it would be quite, well, quite rotted, and some rocks will come under the ground. So yeah, I think it would be, it would be quite rough at the end. Yeah, a good long day for you. We'll see you during the event. That's Adrian Formo. Definitely one of our favourites this weekend in the Rally 2 Fiesta. He's just painted it. I'm going. I mean, honestly, 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 they just painted this and I'm being sent up here. Shall I sing you a song? A song for Guanajuato. Where is my audience? Let's sing for our supper. <laughs> Oh dear, you didn't want to hear that, did you? 
Uh, there we are, folks. A flavor of the recce here at the Rally of Nations. It's going to be cracking, as I mentioned earlier. Some really famous stages, classic stages from the World Rally Championship and the very best street stage in all of the world. So much to look forward to this weekend at the Rally of Nations.